I want to be someone who manages the land and looks after the land because when we talk about biodiversity, you know, we've been doing bio blitz here and, and watching what we've got. And, you know, I want to care for everything on, so therefore I need to manage everything. But I started out with raised beds right outside the window and it was only through developing the land that we got bigger. So we've just adapted to what we've got. My name is Joanne Butler and um, my garden is called Organic Gardens. Um, it's a four acre site based in Gorda Hork uh, here in Donegal and basically we've been developing the site since 2009 to be able to feed our own family but it's taken on a different role in that now, it's included the community um, and also to try and educate people and, and educate families the same way that we learnt, you know, bit by bit and how um, easy and fun it is to grow food and to also have a lovely garden as well. To have diversity of life in your garden, to look at it from all angles, that it's not just a garden for me, that it's a garden for the insects, it's a garden for the animals and the birds, and I want to be able to provide for them as much as I'm providing for myself. So it's that fine balance, I'm working with nature rather than against it. Well, number one, I would say to understand and appreciate because as I said there, you know, my garden is a garden. It's not my garden. I'm only the caretaker of this garden for the time that I'm going to be here. So it's to understand and appreciate what's there. We're using chemicals is a big no-no here. We've been able to create this garden without using any fertilizers, pesticides or herbicides. We learn to appreciate our weeds. So learn to love your weeds because they're there, they're telling you something. When we create bare soil, Mother Nature sends weeds in to heal that soil. That we've all been taught now, it's within our psyche, is to vilify weeds. We, what is a weed? A weed is a plant that's in the wrong place. But also, a weed has developed every single skill to survive except to grow in straight lines. And what we think about weeds out there um, I think it's really important that we start to shift that because if we go and we spray it and we're trying to get rid of it all the time, we're damaging the soil but we're also really damaging ourselves. There's a lot of weeds out there that if you actually find out, if you do a bit of research just by even googling what they are, you can find out that these weeds are actually herbs that'll help us heal in certain ways. So there's plantain and there's chickweed and like I use it for my children's skin. Also save your own seed. I think it's really, really important, especially this pandemic has shown us the importance of seed. Seed is our method of growing food and flowers and they're, they're creating that abundance um, of our flora. Uh, so to save your own seed, because we really need to go back to our heritage and start saving seed within our communities. So one thing that's really important, what we do here is we build soil. So we, we build it from the, 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 the raw material that we have, which some people would call is scrap from their kitchen or cuttings from around the garden. And we put it into a composting system. And from that composting system, we turn it, we, we introduce heat um, and we create soil. And in one handful of soil, you've got more microorganisms than you have people on this earth. But we have to look after our soil and build that that food web and really look after that because there's a certain amount of soil on the top, um, I think a couple of inches uh, that, that provides us of everything that we need on this earth. Another thing I would say is to get involved. Get involved with your local community. If you don't have a garden, there's community gardens out there. There's over 30 in Donegal altogether. Get involved with the Biodiversity Data Centre. They're always looking for data. Here, as I say, we do bio blitzes. So we go around and we look at, you know, at the fl flora and the fauna at different times of the year. So we know what's happening every month. Ecosystem services in Ireland alone is worth 2.6 billion euro to the economy every single year. So we have got a, a duty to care for it. And I think that's really, really important.